Hey there, I'm Tony with Philpiece, and I'm going to show you how to measure system capacity with your Joblink psychrometer probes. The capacity of a system is its ability to heat or cool a given amount of space. Now for heating, this value is expressed in BTUs, and for cooling, in tons, where one ton is equal to 12,000 BTUs. Now having the ability to calculate how many BTUs the system is actually delivering and comparing that to the equipment specification gives you another good data point on determining how well the system is performing. And your Joblink probe psychrometers in conjunction with your Joblink app help you do just that. For purposes of this demonstration, we're gonna talk about cooling capacity. And for cooling capacity, we're gonna to need to gather a couple measurements. One, we need two enthalpy measurements that we're gonna use our Joblink probe psychrometers for, and we're gonna need an airflow in CFM measurement or calculation. Now on the airflow side, you have a couple of options. One, you can use a thermal anemometer like the Philpiece STA2 to get a direct air measurement and use that with the volume of your ductwork to calculate what your CFM value is or you can take a total external static pressure measurement using tools like the Joblink manometer probes and then look up the equipment's fan performance data table in order to get an estimated CFM value. Now to get my enthalpy values, I'm gonna use a couple of Joblink psychrometer probes. And they're long flexible wand with a strong sliding magnet, make it easy to install, one at the supply and one at the return. Now they will wirelessly transmit their measurements to the Joblink app up to a thousand feet away, line of sight. In turn, the app will begin to calculate what my enthalpy values are. On the airflow side, I took the static pressure and performance fan data table route and I got my estimated CFM to be 1745. And now the Joblink app will begin to calculate what my real time cooling capacity BTUs are. And I can use that value compare it to the manufacturer's specification, and that's another data point to help me determine how well the system is actually running. And that's how you measure and calculate system capacity with the Joblink psychrometer probes.